You're watching PLZ Soccer, this is your Thursday English Football Bulletin. Chelsea manager Maurizio Sarri says if his future is to be decided by the Europa League final result, then he wants to leave immediately. There have been links with Sarri taking over at Juventus, as well as rumours the Chelsea board are ready to sack him anyway. And the Italian did say that he will discuss his future with the club, but he was very happy at Stamford Bridge. He added his focus is on Wednesday's Europa League final against Arsenal. My future is on Wednesday, I think. Uh, I need uh, to think only to the final in this moment. I have uh, two, two years of contract here, so I have no contact uh, with other club at the moment. Uh, so I have to speak uh, with my club first of all. The fiasco over the final in Baku continues then, with Arsenal set to meet UEFA after midfielder Henrik Mkhitaryan opted against playing in the match over security fears. Arsenal managing director Vinay Vekhin Shenham says the situation is unacceptable after Mkhitaryan's safety was a concern because of his dispute between his country and Azerbaijan, which is of course the host nation of the final. In transfer news, Inter Milan have set their sights on Manchester United forward Romelu Lukaku and will make a move for the Belgian once their new manager Antonio Conte is officially confirmed. Conte tried to sign Lukaku for Chelsea two years ago and will have to pay around £70 million for the striker or use winger Ivan Perisic to, as a make-weight to lower United's demands. Conte is rumoured to also be interested in Chelsea's out-of-favour wing-back Victor Moses, so keep an eye on that story as well. And Crystal Palace centre-forward Christian Benteke may leave this summer after a £15 million offer from Chinese Super League club Shandong Luneng. Benteke has only a year left on his deal at Palace, and he could join compatriot Marouane Fellaini at the club and earn £150,000 a week, an increase on his current wage. Thank you very much for watching and remember to see other bulletins you can always visit our YouTube, Facebook or plzsoccer.com.